Margot Robbie is setting the record straight. If you can cast your mind back to September, you might recall that Margot found herself at the center of discussions online after a batch of photographs of her looking distressed made the rounds on social media. In the snaps, Margot is dressed casually and appears to be leaving a residence with a suitcase in hand, though fans were immediately concerned when it appeared that she was crying. Looking towards the ground with a serious expression, the Wolf of Wall Street star could be seen holding a hand over her scrunched up face, looking visibly downcast. To make matters more intriguing, Page Six was one of several outlets to report that the photos had been taken while Margot was leaving the home of Cara Delevingne. The two actors, who starred together in Suicide Squad back in 2016, are known to be close friends, and around the time the photographs were taken, Kara had sparked concern among fans after exhibiting what many deemed to be unusual behavior in the months prior. You might remember that in May, Kara made waves online after fans thought she looked a little uneasy while posing for photos on the Met Gala red carpet. Later that month, she raised concerns yet again during an appearance at the Billboard Music Awards, where observers couldn't help but comment after she lifted up the train of Megan the Stallion's dress on the red carpet, seemingly unprovoked. And more recently, the supermodel was seen walking shoeless and smoking outside an airport in California. On the same occasion, she was filmed looking unusually frantic as she spoke on her phone, before dropping it on the ground several times. So, it was just days after this incident that Margot was seen looking teary-eyed after a supposed visit to the supermodel's home, sparking major worry that things could be awry. However, we're happy to report that Kara was apparently fine, and Margot is finally here to explain what had actually been going on at the time. During a new interview with Vanity Fair, Margot said that soon after the photos of her crying went viral, she received a phone call from her mom, who was keen to check in on both her and Kara.